Let's see where we're at. I have no idea. Our hosts at the hotel have invited us um, to go on a drive with them down to Camargu, which is the area that has the flamingos and the wild bulls. And as they call it, it's very savage, which just means wild. But anyways, we're so looking forward to it. And um, hopefully we're gonna see some new interesting territory. Carol, the owner of the hotel, one of the owners, uh, said that Camargu is the uh, life essence of Arl. So um, it should be like the, I don't know. Yeah. Just the, the coolest thing. And then she also set up something with the oh. fish. Yeah, and we're going to meet a fisherman, and there's these tiny little cockles. They're like the size of your fingernail. <laughs> and uh, we're meeting this guy who, that's like his specialty. This right. is all he does. They're, they're like really hard to like yeah. gather or something like that. Yeah, yeah, it's supposed to be crazy. So, anyway, so. we can go hang out with him. Yeah, see what it's meet all about. People. Should be fun. An excursion. We've made it into the van, Silva's temp ride. Say hello. Uh. <laughs> He's gonna be our tour guide for the day. It's gonna be it's gonna be pretty rad. I'm, we're we're look, definitely looking forward uh, to doing this. So we're just headed down there. I think it's only like 20 minute drive or something like that. So we should be there pretty quick. Should come fun. Some flamingos, right? Flamingos. They're big. They're big. <laughs> Silva has taken us over to a little town called Saint Marie, which is this cute little fishing village. It's a big church here. It's like this village of all white stucco buildings with the old clay tile roofs and like the entire town. There's not a building yeah. that's not in uniform. <laughs> Right. It's so cute. So we're just gonna kind of walk around it for a little bit. Probably gonna get a bite to eat, hopefully. I'm getting kind of hungry. I've been to summer down. This place is crazy packed because it's near the beach. Everything but off season, it's pretty quiet. It's nice. Go this way. Apparently they're taking us to a very typical Kamagu bar. He said it's, you know, kind of a dive bar. Maybe a little sketchy because people tend to drink too much, which is, I think, is perfectly acceptable in a fishing village in the south of France. So, at least we're going with people, but no fish. What do you think? I think it's pretty good. So we've been welcomed into his name is Forrest. Forrest is home. Shay Forrest. It's a pretty cool guy. But he want, they're wanting to uh, have us try all the uh, the traditional Saint Marie cuisine. So I'm pretty sure we've got like fish jello coming up. Some kind of terrine. Definitely some snails. Definitely saw some snails back there. So and then some poisson, some fish. So it is going to be an interesting lunch. It's pretty cool though. Everybody's just, everybody's just kind of hanging out, drinking beers. It's a friend's house. Yeah. 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 How's it going? Good. We were um, having a beautiful lunch of head cheese and snails uh -huh. and uh, some raw meat <laughs> and, and, and a beautiful mi salad. 
There's fish coming. And, oh, and there's more coming. So it'll we'll be very full soon. Yeah. Okay, do it again. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm in my car. 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 <laughs> this is what the French do. Yeah. It's just lunch on a Friday, you know? Yeah. Casual. Casual. <laughs> it's been good. I've got the rose. It's very good. Oh, I got the, the wildest poodle just walked by. You have to go get, get a picture of I'll the poodle. Picture of the, poodle. the poodle will come out. Tell me about it. He's coming. Wow. <laughs> Camera shy. <laughs> I feel you, Paul. Oh. <laughs> okay, so we just, I don't even know where to no, start with that. <laughs> <laughs> I just had the funniest lunch of my life. Literally the funniest lunch of my life. I have no idea what has been said for the last two hours, but nope. everybody's been laughing, maybe at our expense, no idea. Um, Mostly just been playing the charades for about three hours. Right, charades. So for those of you at home that don't know what terrine is, it's basically like a meat jello. Oh, we're just not used to eating like that. I mean, no, I mean no. it's it's this literally is, not bad. No, it's and, not. And it's just like, not this used is to delicious. it. Delicious, and they're like, this is so typical of this area. It's amazing. The well, fish was good. I mean, oh, so the snails. Like the the snails were good. I just had the, the snails were good. Yeah, yeah. I used to eat escargot. I just yeah. can't anymore. <laughs> And then uh, spaghetti with clams, and then there was like this potato thing. Oh man, the potatoes were good. Oh, with olives, like everything was amazing. And was, they were just funny. I mean, they're obviously just sitting around laughing. So much you know, wine. The A lot of and wine. And then figs served in like ethanol. <laughs> like, <it was> like, <laughs> those were those were some deadly ads. Corsican figs. Yeah. So strong, delicious. Right. But like, oh man, three sheets. Three right. sheet figs, that's what we're gonna call them. Three sheet figs. So, <laughs> so we're coming to the church. Look, church. Hey guys, church. It's supposed to be pretty cool. We're gonna check it out. I don't even know if it's open, honestly. Oh, that's the little thing you were talking about. The anchor with the heart. Mm -hmm. The church is really cool. It's closed. You, sometimes when it's open, you can go to the top and actually see out over the Mediterranean. I'll give you a look at the top. We can walk down to the beach. I think the beach is right there. Around down this little alley. See the church? Right. Right there. Church. We found the Mediterranean. What? Yes, the Mediterranean Sea. It's right. It's right there. We found it. Pretty amazing. Just everybody's out here fishing. Wouldn't you? <laughs> 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 Do you know how to get home? No. 
but look at that. No, we have to get yeah, home. In, we have to get home in ten minutes. Yeah, home. Actually, we don't know where home it's is. It's the bar. It's the bar slash house. Editing this out. <laughs> Fun. Explain the place that we were going to. Forrest's place. He goes, it's a typical Kamangu restaurant. He goes, it's a little rough. Everybody drinks too much. It's dangerous. It's dangerous. <laughs> cool. It was cool. It actually it was. was. Cool. To get a glimpse of what, you know, everyday life looks like. And then he was talking about how, you know, the quality of life in Kamangu is so good. And I have to agree. I think it's amazing. Guys, my dog. All right. So today, things to be thankful for. Yeah. Number one, uh, the hotel we're staying in. It's amazing. Maison Volvert. It means to come again, and I believe we will. Number two, going to Camargue was a total surprise. A sweet treat for my friends here who drove us around. They didn't have to. It was just so nice. And then number three, getting there and being invited to go to... Shea Forest. <laughs> Shea Forest. It was absolutely the highlight of the day. Um, Forrest is such a character. Apparently, he's really only open to locals. Um, he doesn't take in tourists. And so us being invited there was a really big deal. And let me just say that from beginning to end, the service, although it was in this like kind of rowdy atmosphere, he did not miss a thing. Oh. There was like aperitif. There was, you know all these different courses, all, all the way down to like figs soaked in brandy and dessert and after dinner or after lunch drinks and then espresso and I mean it just never stopped. Yeah, no, it was, you know, it was one of those experiences that you, you don't expect to happen and then when it does happen you're, you're completely thankful for being just and the in the moment we were like so overwhelmed by what was happening that we didn't even think to you know like take out a camera or whatever. <laughs> right. Yeah, but we apologize. So much going on. Yeah. No, no, no. no I mean, we, we, didn't. we lived in the moment. It was beautiful. Right. Right. And, and right. we're just so thankful that, anyways, that they even um, our friends here even trusted us enough to take us there. So that was really nice. Oh, and, that's cool. Like it was cool. You know. Great. I mean, it was just a really good way to end. I mean, we're coming to the end of of Arl. And it was nice to be able to, you know, go and do that. Um, anyway, you know, before we sweet left, so. dreams thinking of our time here because it yeah. was just a dream. It All was right. so sweet. All right, so we're done for the night. I think we're going to go have a glass of wine and call it a night. See you later. Hey, if you're having fun watching our videos, we'd love it if you hit the subscribe button. Also, if you click on that bell, you'll get a notification as soon as we have a new video posted. And we've got a lot more coming your way.